What's up, Soil Brothers and Soil Sisters? All right, y'all. You remember a couple weeks ago we started a uh, fire cider. I will link that video just in case you missed it. I showed you how I started my fire cider. It was time to strain and get that fire cider ready so we can consume it every day to keep our immune system up. So many benefits to it. Check it out. However, my husband is not too fond of the vinegar taste and smell. So what did I do? I freeze dried our fire cider. So go with me and I'm going to show y'all what we did with this fire cider to make it easy for people who do not like vinegar. This is what's left of the fire cider. All of the solids. I'm gonna put them in the blender. And we're gonna grind it all up. Meet me at the freeze dryer. Right, fam. So, oops, <laughs> kick the camera. This is our fire cider. <laughs> After I freeze dried the fire cider, so I have a container to put it in that I'm gonna attempt to work with. I'm gonna put a um, oxygen absorber in there. It's pretty weird. And vinegary ish. But it is completely dry, and that's what we wanted. So we're going to load this thing with all four of our trays. And we're going to move on to the next step. Here we have, oh, um, I ordered these vegetarian um, capsules. I got the double zero size. These things come in different sizes. So I got a double zero, which is like a standard size for a supplement, which is this size. And this one come with a little kit to help stuff your capsules. This is my freeze-dried fire cider. So I figured this way it would be easier for my husband who does not like vinegar to consume <laughs> fire cider daily especially when um it's cold and flu season like now so these are very easy to do just pull one end off one end is bigger than the other so this is like the bottom and this is like the top so you want to take the bigger end which is i want to say the bottom and fill it up
with powder, whether it's cayenne, um, whatever kind of, you want to get your greens in this way, you powder your greens, but you fill up this bottom piece, which is the bigger half. with a daily dose of fire cider. And then you stick the little top back on. And there you have, let me come close so I can show you. There you have your capsules. Fire cider. Without the bad taste. I think it's a good idea for people who cannot stand the taste of um, vinegar. You know. Because this is some powerful stuff but it's good for cold and flu season. So now we have fire cider capsules to get us through the winter. So what do y'all think? Fire cider capsules for the win. <laughs> so with that being said, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you can be notified every time we drop a new video. Until next time, peace.